Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a review, open box, um, first impressions on a new product that I've been seeing on the Sephora website and I wanted to try it out for myself. I am a big eyeliner fan, so I cannot live without eyeliner. Like 99% of my videos I'm always wearing eyeliner even if I'm not wearing any makeup because I feel like it makes me just look awake and stuff. So I went to Sephora and I got the new holiday set. I think every every year they come out with different sets but this is the first time I'm, I have actually seen the um, eyeliner kit. I don't know if I've just not seen it before but this is the Sephora favorites draw the line eyeliner sampler. And it actually comes with two full-size products. But anyways, it comes in a little mirror box. And then it has a little tie. So you have to untie it. And it comes with six eyeliners. And I feel like you can't really see it because of the glare. So I will show you each eyeliner individually. I think it comes with two full-size products. Which so it comes with the Urban Decay 24-7 um, waterproof liquid liner in perversion. I've actually tried this before and I love this um, eyeliner because it's really um, dark and you can get a really precise line. So this one is not a big surprise to me. This is what the brush looks like. I can't really tell. But I'm going to swatch it and it doesn't look as dark. What's wrong with you eyeliner? Maybe I didn't shake it. But that's what it looks like. Alright, so the next one is the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner and Trooper. That's what it looks like. I've never seen this one before, but I guess you shake it and pull out the cap. Oh, and it's like one of those like felt tips. Ah, I'm like really bad at this camera because I don't have a viewfinder, so I'm trying my best. And you just press it and it's this one's the Kat Von D one this one right here so it looks really dark but it doesn't look as dark black as the Urban Decay one so next is the Bare Essentials Buxom um, Insider Eyeliner I think this is focused and this is just a technical liner. Ooh, this looks pretty dark. It's the third line. It's not black though. If you can tell, it's a little bit of a charcoal gray. Um, this is the next one that I think it is full size and this is the Sephora retractable eyeliner and it's waterproof. And I think this is just, oh, it's glitter black. So I'm guessing this has glitter in it. It doesn't really look like it does. Actually it does. This is really nice and smooth. It's the little short line right here. Ooh, I think I'm gonna really like this as well. I'm really excited for this little palette. I think it's a great purchase. So I think that is full size as well. So this is one of the ones that I'm really excited about and it's the Makeup Forever Aqua Eyes um, eyeliner and this one's a number 10. Here's a swatch of it. Very smooth. It's not as dark as I thought though. It's kind of it's kind of a charcoaly gray. But it's a really dark charcoaly gray. And the last one is the Smashbox Jet Set Waterproof Eyeliner in Midnight Black. And this is a gel eyeliner. And this is what it looks like. And in order to swatch this, I actually need an angled eyeliner brush. And I'm just going to take it. Wow. I'm impressed. This gel liner is actually so the eyeliner is um so the gel eyeliner is something that I actually see myself using. I am not a really big fan of gel eyeliners only because I feel like I have to clean the brushes every single time and it gets really annoying. Um but other than that, I think this is an eyeliner that I'm totally gonna reach for. It's very dark and black, and I think it's totally worth it. But all these eyeliners look great so far. Um, the third one, which I think was the um, Buxom one, is actually like a really dark brownish black gray blue, kind of. Like all those four colors mixed together. But um, 
here are the swatches I just need to try them out on my eyes and once I do I'm actually gonna post some pictures probably like on, on Instagram so you can follow me there if you want to and you can see the swatches of the eyeliners and stuff so um, that's pretty much it for today's video don't forget to follow me on Instagram so you can see the pictures that I am going to post and I will link it in the bottom bar but it's Missy Kissy XO it's I think it's pretty self-explanatory you can also follow me on Twitter if you don't have an Instagram you can see all the pictures from my Instagram because I link them both into my Twitter so you can see them on Twitter as well and um, that's pretty much it so I hope you guys enjoy this video give it a thumbs up and I will talk to you guys later and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already okay bye